That's how you feeling? Well, today is finally race day and the excitement is high along with the nerves. If you're just joining us, we're at Hubapalooza, the season opening event for the Inland Northwest held in Spokane, Washington. Sarah and I have been practicing for the last couple weeks in preparation for this race. Uh, it's a little bit chilly out, but so far we seem to be having some good weather. The climb to the top of stage one took about 45 minutes and I was really feeling all the riding that I did earlier in the week. All right, we are on the climb up stage one right now. Pretty sure I'm in dead last on the way up. It's not a race at the top, but... Ooh, it's a cold breeze though. That is for sure. I'm gonna save battery until we get to the top though. So we'll see you guys up there. Thanks. Thanks. Taking the shoot. Oh, we're good. Fuck, that hurt. Damn it. Shit, man, I did that just fine in practice. Oh well. <sighs> Although I had that stupid crash and rode half the stage with crooked bars, I was feeling pretty good. Stage one ended up biting both myself and Sarah. She had this nasty little get off during the stage two. GoPro still on. But she did completely nail the top section. This is where we were paying special attention to in our last video. You should check out the practice day video just to see how far out of her comfort zone she was because she killed it here. I pedal straight. Uh, I stopped. And then I lost my balance and my bike tipped over, so it wasn't even cool. Oh. I was like, no, no! And then I was like, <laughs> Down the hill. Well, at least we both got our big crashes out of the way on the first stage. Uh, what did you do? Uh, that chute it is super loose because everybody's been hitting it. So when I landed, I don't know exactly what happened, but in my head, my front tire washed out when I jumped off the ledge and I just went over the bars. You'll have to get pictures of my battle Yeah. On the transition up to stage two, the weather decided to turn nasty. Uh, naturally, the rain held off until it was time for us to drop in, so sorry about any water on the lens. Three, two, one, go! Ugh. Still don't remember this very well. Where are we going? Right down here. Oh, the old lake. Oh, it's so stormy. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, oh, oh. come on. Oh, wet Woo. Woo. Well, it's literally like 30 minutes later from that last stage and the sun is already back out. That is awesome. What's not awesome is how bad this hurts. <laughs> Definitely not used to multiple ascents in a day yet. Woo! It's like a theme park line. Damn hard. Got a bunch of rain coming. I'm not looking forward to it. I can actually see it falling. Ah. This is like a lot harder than I anticipated for a first race. I don't think any drop that you can't roll is less than a foot. Uh, commitment issues, that log that's laying on, across, and then it like, it's it's not rollable. So if no. you tried to roll it, you'd go over your bars. Yeah. I straight jumped off that one. Oh, you did it? No, <laughs> I like picked my bike. Oh, you <laughs> jumped off got out and jumped. Nice. Yeah, I totally did a drop. Luckily, the rain in the distance skirted us, so there was no more rain for the day. The next stage was both my favorite and my least favorite. The top section was super fun, flowy, and had some killer jumps, but the last half was just a flat pedal sprint that left you gassed. You got it. You good? This next section is gonna suck because it's a lot of pedaling. Pedal. Dang it, dang it. Gonna lose time. Oh. Pine cones. Oh. A lot of pedaling. <laughs> oh <my God>. uh, <laughs> kill me <laughs> so for this pedal section if you compare Sarah's time against my time she totally blew me out of the water so she's still the best climber of our group and me not so much now I need to try and get on her level nice job <laughs> didn't die nice. nailed it <laughs> I'll call that a win <laughs> thanks no dead <laughs> Now we're on to the last stage for the day. Everyone is pretty tired and maybe even a little hangry, but spirits are still high. There's actually a super long wait on this one, so we decided to go down and scope a few lines while we were waiting for the crowd up top to thin out a bit. The second half of this stage is actually one I've recorded a couple times already for you guys, but I was definitely a lot more exhausted this time around. One, go. Oh, oh, jumpies. 
riding this blind, by the way. Oh, 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 where am I going? Right here? Okay. Oh man, it is windy. Ah, slowed down too much. Gotta be smoother. Woo! Ah! Oh man, you guys. Yeah, I'm so excited for this porter potty at the end. Oh man, that's it. Whew. That is the end. First race of the year. And I didn't die too bad. Oh man, cramping. Cramps, cramps for days. And that wraps up the first event of the year and Sarah's first mountain bike race ever. Oh, really? That's the end? <laughs> I picked the wrong one. I was like, no! <laughs> We're done, though. Ah, food. food. Let's go to the truck. Yes. This was a super fun race, but I think what made it even better was all the people that recognized me and said, hey, uh, that's really cool and definitely a new experience for me. But we all had a blast riding our bikes, and I think Sarah might actually be hooked on this. What you, okay, what position do you think you got? Either second or last. Second or what? Last. What? Third. Okay. Second or third. If you're not first, you're last, too. <laughs> I ended up finishing 11th out of 18 entrants in the sport class, and Sarah got third of three entrants in the beginner class, which gives us a good baseline to build off of. My first main goal is to be able to get consistent top 10s in the sport class. I hope you enjoyed following us during this race. If you'd like to see more content like this and help us out, please share this video with a friend and give it a like. Subscribe if you want to keep up to date with all of our adventures and projects, and please comment below. We love hearing from all of you. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep the rubber side down.